bush babies eat bugs, leaves, and fruit. What kind of food do you eat? It's easy and fun to make bush baby bug snacks. Here are the ingredients we used, but you can be creative with the types of foods that you enjoy. Let's take a look. I see some grape tomatoes. And then there's some, I think that's, yep, cream cheese. Some hummus. Kiwi. We use blueberries strawberries, grapes, apples, and then we even use some mini chocolate chips. Yum. We use cucumber, celery, and olives. Mint leaves, lavender, basil, and cilantro were used for decoration. Let's get ready for some delicious treats. Here are the bugs that we made. First, Caterpillars, aren't they adorable? On the first caterpillar, we spread a piece of celery with cream cheese and stuck grapes on for the body. A tomato was used for the head. On the other caterpillar, we used a toothpick and we speared tomatoes and olives for the body and used a grape for the head. The eyes were made of mini chips and celery leaf stems were used for the antennas. Next, we made some snails. We scooped out a half of mini cucumber and added some hummus and used an apple slice for the shell and tomato for the head. The second snail had a cream cheese and celery body. And then our third little snail had celery and hummus and then a cucumber for a shell. We made the faces with the chocolate chips and celery leaf stems for antennas just like the caterpillars. Our third bug snack was butterflies. Aren't they beautiful? Bodies were made with celery and cream cheese. For the wings, we used slices of strawberries and kiwi. How pretty. Blueberries were added to the bodies and heads were made of grapes and strawberry. The lavender and mint were the final touch. This was my favorite bug snack of all. So now, it's your turn to create some yummy bug snacks and fill your tummy just like the bush babies that live in Africa.